What is a brick? What is a brick? Not this. Not this. Nor this. This. And this. And this. Okay, what are we talking about? We're talking about a way of conceptualizing bricks, a way of talking about the building blocks of our world. I'm Aya. I'm the founder and CEO of Little Bits. And I'm David Benjamin, principal of The Living and assistant professor of architecture at Columbia University. Okay, so the world we inhabit, the world we've designed is made of all types of bricks, not just those. It begins with concrete blocks. The first were manufactured in 1868. A simple idea, modules of a fixed measurement that fit together. Very quickly, concrete blocks became the most used construction material in the world. They enabled us to build things that were larger than us. Buildings, bridges, towers, one brick at a time. Almost a hundred years later, in 1947, Lego came out with this. In the same year, Bell Labs came out with this. The transistor would take us from a world of small plastic bricks stacked on top of each other to a world that's completely interactive. A programmable world of pixels, cells, images and data. Malleable pieces that added, added together, together to form meanings, systems, behaviors. Bricks can be made of literally anything. This brick was grown in a mold using mushroom mycelium. It was used to build this. It's a 40-foot tall tower strong enough to survive hurricane winds and 5,000 visitors a week. But it's also biodegradable, made of local agricultural waste, zero carbon footprint. Or these. These little bits can be connected to form circuits. You can combine them to make machines that do this, and this, and this. No, not that. That's too complicated. But that's also made of bricks. The point of bricks is to divide the infinite complexity into graspable parts. Thus increasing the number of people who can understand and play with it. Even kids. Especially kids. If the 20th century was a century of physics, ours is a century of biology. Engineering must now imitate the organism. We need to show that ours isn't a world of incomprehensible technological magic. Our world is made of parts, parts that can be removed, recycled, and recombined to make other things. In other words, a modular world. A world, a world made, made of, of bricks. bricks.